Welcome to today's edition of Tremaine's Trucks how-to series of videos. Today we're going to be installing some door activated dome light switches in your 67 to 72 Chevy and GMC pickups, Suburbans, K5 Blazers and Jimmies, C10s through C60s. Here's the tools we're going to use today. You're going to need a center punch, a drill, 11 30 seconds. I recommend you use a step bit to get a nice round hole in the sheet metal. This will also work for the 5 16 or thereabout, depending on the grommet that you need to drill the hole in the inner kick panel. You're going to need a 5 16 socket and or a Phillips screwdriver quarter inch ratchet, an extension, and a 7 16 socket. Stay tuned as I show you how we do this conversion so when you open your door the dome light will come on automatically and it will turn off when you shut the door. Okay so you'll need to locate this square stamp pad that's in your door jam right here right in the center of it. Take your punch, give it a couple of good punches there. Take your step bit, drill it out to an 11 30 second hole. Okay, now you're going to have to drill a hole in the kick panel for the wire to go through to the switch and the door jam. You can see I've already drilled this hole right above the rod and the lever that opens your fresh air vent. Now you're going to have to take this lever off of here to get to the hole. And you want it to be right above this guide so it doesn't interfere like so. You can see on the passenger side I've already drill the hole as well. You can drill it up a little bit higher because you don't have the parking brake to interfere. So once you've got the hole drilled in the kick panel, you can feed the wire through. It goes to the switch. I recommend using a grommet to protect the wire from the bare metal. Push it through there. Okay, the tricky part is getting this end of the wire through the hole in the door jam. Once you do, connect it to the switch. Get your 716 socket, ratchet, and extension. The switch has threads on it that are going to cut their own threads into the door jam here. So make sure you're going in there square. Give it a little force, get the thread started. Again, be very certain you're going in square. Tighten it up snug, not too tight, so you strip it out. There's your switch installed in the door. Repeat the process on the other side. We'll go on to hooking up the wires. Okay, the last step is to hook up the wires. So you want to take your long wire, it goes to the other side, the passenger side door switch. Run it up over the column, along the bottom of the dash. They have these clips on them here. Should be two clips that will attach to the pinch weld up under the dash on the right side of the cigarette lighter and then underneath the glove box. Keep it in place. Kind of a pain in the butt again to get to if you have your dash all intact. So you go under here, coming right out of the fuse box. There's an orange and a yellowish orange wire and a white wire coming out going into this plug. Unplug it. Take your dome light switch plug. Plug this one into here. This one into here. Good to go. Now you should have door activated dome light. Okay, so now you can see when you open the door, dome light comes on, shut the door, goes off, 
kind of nice little courtesy light when you open the door in the dark you don't have to fumble for the headlight switch the light still works off the headlight switch just the same as it did before you added the dome light switches in the door nice little improvement if you ask me so if you're gonna pull these out of a parts truck yourself here's what you're gonna need you need the door switches they just unscrew with a 7 16 socket out of the door jam then unplug the end from the end of the wiring harness pull the wiring harness through you want to take the complete harness unplug it nothing to cut I recommend getting the clips that attach the wire underneath the glove box they'll come in handy I do have some of these kits in stock used pretty much what you see here I hope this video did you some good thank you for watching